team, there's an invasion underway in Arizona this morning. The Oregon Ducks and their fans are in the Phoenix area now. They're getting ready for the NCAA Final Four. Coin Six's Cole Miller arrived last night. He's live with more on the action. Cole Miller, take it away. Well, Ken, Trevor, good morning. First of all, I just have to say it is so nice to be able to be reporting outside live without a heavy winter coat or a rain jacket. But that's not the reason we're here. No, we are following that Oregon Ducks basketball team. These young men continuing to write an incredible story. This memorable march not over yet. Now, I don't want to open up old wounds, but the last time the Duck faithful were down here, it was a few years back. It was the football team playing here at University of Phoenix Stadium, taking on Trevor. Ohio State Buckeyes, those fans, they left a little heartbroken. But if this Ducks basketball team has anything to say about that, they'll be leaving here on top. And as fans continue flocking down this way, there's a bar dubbing itself Autzen in the Desert. It was started by a fellow from Eugene a few years back. They're welcoming everyone with open arms. We stopped by there late last night as soon as we touched down. Take a look. Original Oregon Duck Bar in Arizona. It's been here for about 10 years now. We decided we were going to make it the best Oregon bar in Arizona, and that's what we did. We had probably about 120 people here for the Elite Eight game. It gets loud. We are the loudest, proudest Oregon fans in Arizona. This is where everybody comes to watch the games. If you're from Oregon, you know about the Well Bar, and you're going to come here and watch the game with us. Our ducks are here. How much more exciting could it be? We are so proud, and we just want to cheer them on and let them know we're here for you. We've been here the whole time. We are here for you in Arizona. This is Oregon and Arizona, right here at the Well Bar. Go You heard it there, the loudest and the proudest Duck fans in the desert. So if you don't plan on coming to the stadium here, I can't blame you. You don't want to fork over an arm and a leg for tickets. They are certainly not cheap. Now, later today, that's when the fun and festivities really get going. We're talking a Ducks pep rally tonight over at the Phoenix Convention Center. Entertainment, games, concerts, you name it. We'll be down here covering it all. David Solano will be down here. He'll have all the action on the hardwood, all the post-game press conferences and things like that. Jeff Gianola also joining us tomorrow. So needless to say, it is going to be a fun, busy whirlwind of a few days down here in Phoenix. We are live actually though right now in Scottsdale. I'm Cole Miller for Coin 6 News. We'll send it back to you. All right, Cole. I've actually been to that bar. It is a really great time. Uh, I imagine uh, Jeff Gianola and David Solano are probably still asleep right now, right? They're getting revved up for their I cover. would have to imagine so. <laughs> yeah, David I know is. He's still back at the hotel. I think Jeff, he's actually going to be joining us from New York City. He's actually cutting a family vacation short. That's how bad he wants to be here covering this historic march. All right. Thanks, Cole. Thanks, Great Cole, job. Yep. Yeah, go grab a power yeah. nap. We've got a couple big days ahead <laughs> Absolutely. of you. Absolutely. Yeah. Of course, Coin 6 is your home for coverage of the Final Four and the entire NCAA tournament. Cole is joined by David Solano and Jeff Giannola, as you just heard in Phoenix. We're going to be bringing you live updates through the weekend here on Coin and on Coin.com. Yeah, and for Cole, this is completely out.